Hey there guys, welcome to the stream. This is uh, part 2 of our playthrough of Maniac Mansion on the uh, Amiga. Hope you guys are having a nice little Wednesday, just setting up. Satchel here, wanted live in the background. I need a little bit of background music, the um, game is relatively quiet, not a lot of audio going on, also uh, thanks for the follow Carlotta Marx and uh, Fragilities, Fragilities just followed when I went online, welcome in. Might not uh, have a stream on Friday, I'm probably going out of town, should be back for Saturday, if not uh, we'll do a catch up stream on Sunday. Won't, uh, we've gotten a little behind in Madden Magic, we, I won't skip the Delta Saturday, if I'm not home on Saturday I'll do a Sunday stream instead. Might uh, skip the Betrayal at Grondor stream on Friday though. We decide not to go, which I find unlikely. Just the system camera here a little bit. Pretty fight the Amiga a little bit. Looking pretty good. Maybe tune down the music a little bit here. There we go. Now, uh, we're only about two hours of playing time into this game, and uh, we're still a little bit stuck here. So I don't think there's much to do here. This is just where I saved. Don't know. You never know with these games. Uh, what is just a gag? And, uh, what isn't? For example, with the uh, man-eating plant here, we fed her a can of Pepsi. Uh, now she's burping a lot. Impossible to tell whether we're actually supposed to uh, do something else with it or whether that's just a just a running gag in the game. Hey there, Coffee Cup Arcade. Welcome in. Good afternoon to you. sort of know what to do in here, we just don't know how to do it yet. There is a bottle of development fluid down on the first floor, but uh, it's out of reach for us at the moment. There are so many rooms here, seemingly so many things to do, so many puzzles to solve. Alright, for Zach McCracken and the Alien Mindbenders. <laughs> Another hint to the gas can.
a running gag between games because uh, on Inside McCracken, the uh, when you found the can, it says it's for another game, and uh, in this game, it's being referenced because we need the, <laughs> need the gas can can for the chainsaw. We can't operate without it. We, uh, we broke this ways when we uh, played one of the records on the on the uh, on the Victrola. Uh, we have two of them. We have something called an old record, which is just sound effects. Then we have a record that we found in the upstairs bedroom called the uh, tentacle mating sound. We used to break the chandelier down on the first floor. We sort of figured out that puzzle. Hey there, I make a kami. Welcome in. Seemingly so many things to do here, but uh, not a clue how to do some of them. We uh, figured out most of the easy puzzles last stream. Uh, certainly not all of them. There's another... Another cassette player here, we used it to uh, break the chandelier. I wonder if we can... Uh I assume this is just for playback. We can also turn on this radio. Uh, 
doesn't seem to be tuned into anything really. This is where the chandelier fell down. We found a key which we haven't been able to figure out. What exactly unlocks? Can't go up this staircase, it's uh, apparently out of order. Already found a loose panel and a stole was in it. Hey there, please welcome in. Sort of thinking the next thing we try is to uh, get ourselves put into the uh, into the locked room see if that helps us in any way we already recruited the kid and, uh, if we walk into the uh, the lady of the house's bedroom she will put us in definitely put us lock us down in the on the first floor or in the basement wondering if there's something we can do there this stage i think it's this door actually oh an unwelcome visitor i got you seems you do was silly of me could have tied you to my bed Ay, ay, that's a fate worse than dying. This guy's been around. Sacred lab. Two padlocks. I wonder if we, uh, have any of these keys none of these at least this is just a key to the outside door total we have Three keys. Door is locked. There's also this, we discovered this last stream. There's a, there's a water valve here, which we can turn off. Sort of attracts their attention. Empty again, we're going to have another meltdown, he says. Okay, 
gonna take over the world on a mono budget. Let's get stuck with cheap equipment. Or is the music going to be pissed? Pantagon front and center. Yes, sir, Dr. Fred, sir. Purple tentacle at your disposal, sir. Quick, go check out the reactor. Yes, sir. Just a wondering if uh, this would enable us to get in there, but uh, where we could escape into the room while the guy is there, but uh, apparently that's not the case. There's no one here. Let's fix this water valve situation if we don't the uh Place basically blows up. Hey there, I'm a the gamer. Sorry I'm late, I went to a party on the moon. I left early, no atmosphere. Solid. Solid, solid joke. didn't see that before. Canister of undeveloped film. Just hiding there in the grass outside. That's probably the film we're supposed to develop. That's another piece of the puzzle. I'm fairly sure. This is the board grade. Directly uh, directly below the uh, the closet where the developer fluid is currently being hidden. Uh, the fluid is on top of the, the cabinet. If we try to get it down from there, it uh, falls to the floor and breaks. It's a ruined, basically. I think caught wasn't the smartest of ideas. So, we got this film.
There's the crate. And there's the portal. Basically what happens. Conversation carried no weight, yeah, that's uh, one way of putting it. Okay, so the development fluid is just lying there in a the puddle. Um, perhaps. Perhaps we can place it in the jar. Okay. We're able to use the sponge. Take it off from the floor. We then put it in the jar. Yeah, it probably carried no weight because there's no gravity on the moon. Deep joke. Very funny. Now, did we actually manage to do this? Yeah, we did. Doesn't know how, but does Bernard know how? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'm about the same. I've always been pretty bad with them, but uh, now I have three kids. I'm actually somehow getting uh, it's somehow getting worse. You do wonder if Bernard know how knows how to develop film. Out, Bernard. That's not the right door. The name Bernard sticks with me from uh, four weddings and a funeral. Bernard and Lydia. <laughs> that's that's fair enough. That's fair enough for me to throw the game out. Give undeveloped film to Bernard. Use undeveloped film and develop a tray. He doesn't know how. That leaves Wendy. Perhaps he doesn't know how either. And, uh, and maybe we can try to recruit the boy, see if he knows how to do it. 
20 is on aspiring to work in media, perhaps she knows. How to develop a film. Because he doesn't know how either. Okay. Hello. See me when you have the plans. Oh no, you have to develop it for me. I didn't know Eldritch was here. I don't think I saw him. We have to develop it for him, but none of us know how to do that. Hey there, Altrich. Yeah, feel free to lurk, man. That's perfectly fine. You already picked up the film, right? Yeah, okay. Now we go down. The grate. Uh, we use the sponge. In the puddle and put it into the jar. That's what we needed the water for in both the jar and the sponge. It makes sense. Go up the stairs. to the development room. Use the glass jar, pour in the development fluid. We open the film. It's Kotak. 
None of them know how to do this. Yeah, it was somehow supposed to do this. some key ingredient here so halfway there but uh, there's some piece missing I figured out I already tried all of the kids and none of them know how to do this I think it's obvious we're supposed to do this however I think we already figured this bit out We also figured this bit out. Uh, we're at a loss as to exactly how to operate the to mail out the manuscript Might as well put it there. Fairly sure we're supposed to mail it. Fairly sure that we also need the stamps to do so. I can't figure out. How to make the stamps stick on the monument of the manuscript. Now there's no handle on this door. Now this is an excellent game. It's another one of these classic puzzling adventure games. I'm so glad I didn't play all these games back then because now I can play them and enjoy them.
Funny that we have these keys and can't quite figure out what to do with them. Yeah, maybe it's just us that are getting a little bit old. That's also possible. The phone is broken. If we try opening up this chair. Nothing hidden inside the chair, under the cushion or anything like that. That's a point of view onto itself, Glazer. Now, a pair of dull knives over there that are glued to the wall. For reasons that no one knows. Or the anti the refrigerator. This seems like it might be something, but it's not. Also, this gravy stain. This door is locked. None of the three keys that we have operated. Yeah, you're like the weather report. He's like 
Yeah, I forgot to uh, check if some of them can actually play the piano. Possible. He can't play it. Yeah, this is this advertising blurb. This guy that will publish anything. You guys that will publish anything due to two skyscraper way we get the stamp yeah obviously supposed to mail it but uh, how do we which one of these is this that's the tentacle medding calls, okay. That's what broke the vase. When he plays the piano, easy enough to find out. can this is right off her alley she really wants to have a book published If she reacts differently to the others. Oh, no, she doesn't. Okay, neither of them want to touch the slime. Wondering if the same applies to Bernard. No, all of them say the same thing.
I think the plaque on the statue actually talks about Where did I leave Wendy? He's right here. This is another really weird room. There's a medical cabinet here. Uh, neither of the keys that we've managed to find unlocks this particular cabinet. Can't erase the blackboard. I that already. Here's the little arcade room. I think we already tried all of the machines, all of our keys. He says the same about all of them. They require a special key. It doesn't actually do anything. about all of them it says I think it's on but there's no power Yeah, we had a lot of fun in, uh, in Deja Vu. The first game was actually rather good, and uh, Deja Vu 2 was uh, actually pretty promising until we basically reached an impasse. I know how to solve it, but uh, it's just so dumb, I won't go back to it. Now this is a nice little radio, but uh, we're lacking a tube to be able to fix it. And then there's the young tentacles bedroom up here.
Have we already tried playing the mating calls? On this thing. My slimy son, love mom. Let's try interacting with him a little bit. I haven't quite figured out what to do with this guy. Seems you can basically give him all the food. He takes all of it, but uh, nothing really happens. What does he walk away and then... Wait a demo tape, okay, let's hear it. Aha. Uh -huh. The tactical baiting call. Okay, are we dead? <laughs> I think we're dead. Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> okay, that's an excellent joke. Okay, that's up. Gives me an idea though. Go downstairs again. Uh, take the sound effect record and uh, record that onto the tape. Does he want to listen to that? Maybe he does. Seems stupid, but uh, it's worth a shot. Basically the same idea, just with different props. Fairly sure that uh, the 
the sound of this is basically exactly the same as the, uh, the sound that uh, we made on Mars when we recorded the door opening sound. Okay, what does he say about this one? Not bad. A bit more work. Okay, I have one other idea. What if we record both to the same tape? Starting with the old record. Let's go downstairs and listen to this, see what's actually on it. Now it's a combination of the, the special effects and the mating calls. only really records
one thing to the tape. Leave the tape downstairs. Hey there, TC Psycho M1. Welcome in. Struggling with this game tonight, it's uh, it's fun, but uh, there were some difficult puzzles here. Yeah, this was all over the place. Most of the 8 bit platforms and uh, most of the 16 bits as well. So people played it on the C64. Sort of tell by the palette that's being used in this game that it's uh, definitely an 8-bit sort of game. I left the tape downstairs again. Need another need another tape. The simple that retro is coming back that uh, I've started making tapes again. Not only is vinyl picking up, but uh, you can also buy new tapes. This is the old record. Still recording.
trying this again in case uh, we didn't do it quickly enough earlier. It's a long shot though. Theoretically, we should have recorded both of the, of the records onto the single tape now, but uh, I seriously doubt it. No, it starts with the second one that we put on there. Yeah. Okay. Is the tube that we're looking for inside the radio? Yes, it is. He doesn't know, but perhaps Bernard does. But yeah, the puzzles are pretty fiendish in this game. It does. The fact that you have such a large crew to select from somewhat suggests that, uh, that there are many difficult ways to, uh, and different ways as well, to solve the same puzzle. Actually, pretty cool. Oddly enough, the uh, game that most people probably know, which is Monkey Island, is uh, nowhere near as difficult as, uh, for example, Zack McCracken is. Zack McCracken is uh, quite a bit tougher, in my opinion. Monkey Island is more uh, adjusted. Okay, so now we have this amateur radio setup working. Now what? Yeah, the Sierra games, at least the early ones, are. Uh, just sort of figure them out, but uh, the soft locking I really don't like very much. So many different ways to soft lock yourself. What are we tuning into here? Three, one, four, two. What's the shot? That's what it said. Three, four, one, two. This is the Meteor Police. Uh-huh. 
You found a murderous purple meteor. I'll be there in five minutes. Oh, make sure the lap is unlocked. As for you, keep it under light speed. <laughs> Okay, that's progress. Hey there, Broomhatter, welcome in. to make a new save here uh, this might end up killing us we'll start the coolant Pool is empty again. We're going to have another meltdown. I think all the world are on a budget. I'm thinking this might help us with unblocking the lab. This is the only way I can think of actually doing that at this point. Yes, sir, Dr. Fred, sir. Purple tentacle at your disposal, sir. Go check that, yeah, sir. It does open the lab. No one here. No. You can't leave this too long or the whole place will blow. When is the police getting here? <laughs> Happens if we do this again, or again. Will ever take over the world when things like this keep happening? And to go front and center. And um, we got problems again. Yes, sir. Just open the door.
where is it that he's going? Is he going down that door in the hallway that uh, doesn't have a handle? But he is. Oh, now it's automatically broken. Okay, if we stay in here, uh, we have one to pull the valve. We'll set off the alarm once more. This is basically the same cutscene. How about we wait for the tentacle to go down there and then go out in the hall? I thought. Okay, it's not apparently this one. Okay. Could be any number of doors, really. Uh, where is the meteor police? Yes, they only really get here once we've completed some part. Okay, is it this door? Could be. How am I supposed to get in there? It's a question of timing. Could be a question of timing, but uh, continue playing with this anyway. Find out what happens now.
This doesn't appear to be the door either, either that door, there is no way to interact with it during that stage. Hmm. Guess we might just uh might as well just keep doing this. And I hope that uh The uh, media police get here while the door to the lab is open. And basically do this as many times as we want. We seem to be any sort of limit to that. Only thing we can't do is uh, we can't keep it on because. Uh, Eventually the uh, ra reactor runs out of water and uh, then we have a meltdown. A spectacular end scene where everything is blown to bit. And again. Get this cut in. The lab door should be open. One more time. No, it's pretty loud. I'll turn it down. Okay, so we need to be in this room. And we need to figure out a way to open this door. And then someone has to go. Up to the radio. And uh, call them. And then we need to wait for them. But we have no idea how to open these padlocks, there are two of them. We don't have either of the keys at the moment. Uh, at least we sort of know this that we need to do, just uh, as is often the case in these games. Not exactly how to get there. Anything written on either of these keys. The old rusty key and the yellow key.
Mm-hmm. This thing sort of always looks like it opens or closes, but uh, I think I've tried it many times now. In fact, not. And this is often the case in a uh, many of the SC items we don't really know whether they are uh, Move this one. This one you can push. And pull. At least it doesn't say that uh, you can't move it. It does open the door. Ah, this requires two of us. Get Bernard down there. the time for the flashlight again have we conveniently recharged with the open wires upstairs Now we're in this room. There's the reactor. Probably some other things as well. There's a key. 
a few sparks with some circuit breakers radioactive slime yeah watching it or not i'm pretty sure you're dead just by being in there just not quite yet save anyway we're going to uh the door is locked of course it is This key works. Ah, this is this place. Plus, either of these open the padlocks here. Not this one. Not this one either. Okay. At least we are here. Here. What else is here in this infernal machine? Made in Chernobyl. Ouch. <laughs> that's a pretty... That's a pretty cold joke. Cold war joke even. Okay. What to be... Uh... Do we do this now? Yeah, it's not long after the disaster, it's very shortly after the disaster. Still too hot. I'll get you. What you sneaking around our house? After Fred isn't paying me for nothing, the dungeon intruder. I hope you rock. Don't we already have the key to this door? Perhaps it doesn't work on this side. So we do have the key. Okay. We can easily get out of this. 
Better switch to anti and uh, fix this before everything blows up. Shut the power off. Want to have another mess down. Open the furnace now. Okay. Okay. What if we turn off the breakers? Still too hot. Out of this place. Tentacle is going down. We'll find no one there. Because we can't see a thing here. Guess I could use the flashlight. I have to switch over to Bernard. He needs to push the gargoyle. Wrong gargoyle. He needs to push this particular gargoyle. It's still too hot. Okay. Not waste all the batteries and all the flashlight. It's fairly pointless. Wondering if uh, 
if we if we play the tentacle mating calls While he's going down there, what exactly happens? Did he really trigger that? I was going to send him down there. Yeah, this probably does nothing. Hey. We have a new key. Let's find out what we can do with it. Of the, yeah, there, there was the mat medicine cabinet here is locked. So, see if this. No, that's not the key for the medicine cabinet. Not for the coin box either. There's the file cabinet in the uh, development room. No. There's no lock door there I can think of. The one in here. This is one of the weirdest rooms in the game. This is a lovely game though. Absolutely crackingly good. There is that door on the first floor where we found the uh, development fluid. Maybe that's where the well, the silver key fit.
Indeed it does. This is a new place. I was going to say earlier, yeah, uh, taking a look at the pilot from this game, it's, uh, it's pretty obvious that it's uh, somewhat CTA. Influenced, there's a lot of uh, cyan and yellow and red in it. And uh, this uh, weird magenta color as well. Yeah. I, uh, you have to admit that colors are very uh, GTA-like, at least in this particular version of the game. He won't go down there, it's full of water. Doesn't want to get wet. Fine. Some ways they are Sinclair light colors. Okay, we can get out of the gate. There's a garage door here. A big one at that. Water faucet handle. And to go on board. Hmm. Okay, it's locked. Of course it is. A modified rocket engine. can't start it with that so what you can start it with the rocket fuel where are we supposed to find rocket fuel i heart weird ad license plate reads that so nothing else in here we can close the garage door or seemingly not perhaps we don't need to either close the gate close this door Toolbox. Just a bunch of tools.
And what they're both supposed to do with a... This water faucet handle. We have many things to try now. Where's the light switch? There it is. Use the tools on the padlocks. Oh, and on bar the window either. Repair the staircase. No. He doesn't, but Bernard does. I assume this is just another way to call the aliens. Was it three four one two? Three four two one. Then Dave. Leave Wendy down here.
I see with the phone is just another way of uh, calling for existence. What did the poster say? More murderous purple slimy meteor. Three, four, one, two. But we called, right? Point of the phone. We're obviously supposed to dial some other number. Doesn't explicitly say that we can't, but uh, doesn't do anything either. Sock. Here we can dial the, uh, the police. We're not going to be able to unlock the lap, however, because we don't have the keys. need to develop the film, find the plans.
wonder if uh, we can use this sink now. With this uh, brand new water faucet handle. What on earth that actually does for us. of can doesn't actually say anything And turn on this thing. No, doesn't really seem to do very much for us. We could try to figure out this puzzle either. There's a pillow in here. This game is a tough little cookie. The, these puzzles are very fun. Doesn't have the right to. Takes a fair amount of time for this guy to get here. Must be said. I don't actually think we can uh, interact with this in any other way now.
Should we fix the phone? Fairly obvious. We tried the ported up window. Also fairly obvious. Okay. occurs to me what we might use this handle for, we might use it for a door downstairs. No. That's not it. These are the only two faucets I can think of. There's the kitchen sink and the bathroom sink upstairs. Think of any others. must have to use it in combination with something else, I'm just not entirely sure exactly what. We perhaps use it to drain the pool. Uh, if so, where could we possibly do that? want to get in the pool. Could also try that. It's probably not gonna be Bernard, but uh, it might be Wendy. Might as well try our good friend Bernard.
was hoping we could pull this ladder and use it somewhere else. But not an option. No one wants to go in the pool. None of them can reach the radio. Noticed this before. Funny, there's a cement slab underneath the shelf. That in itself isn't all that strange, but uh, why is it there and why can you select it? gas tank or anything of that nature here already have key to unlock the trunk the yellow one nothing in it anymore we already moved the tools There's this shelf and this cement slab below it. Really figure out how we could potentially use that to our advantage. Uh, now it's a pool party. We can easily refill the jar and the sponge with water from the pool. Uh, 
see all that helps us. The game giveth and the game taketh away. It's both of what's happening here. Back here, leave Venti by the pool for a moment. But they have enough stuff that it's uh, can mostly get out of any pickle. Burn it there to uh, press the button for a while. Obviously can't open the furnace as is since it's uh, very warm. A little cold here, I'm going to uh, close the door, be right back. Getting cooler We're in August now. Dark outside and it's actually getting pretty cold at night again. There's something we're missing here somewhere. Start 
find it somewhat curious that uh, we can walk behind the machine like this. I'm wondering if there's an object from the park. Basically, as far as he goes. Doesn't seem to be anything here, anywhere that we could. We know it's locked. We also have the key for it, so... Uh, counter holder in here Okay, is the reason we can go behind the machine so that we can turn off the breakers and hide so he doesn't see us? Yeah, that's uh, sort of what we're doing. We're slowly chipping away with it. One clue at a time. It's basically the same as we did with Sakma Kraken. Okay, let's say that he doesn't see us now. Does that help us? It's going to come down here, obviously. still sees us. What's the point of this?
pretty much perfectly hidden right now. You get Mandy in here to uh, doesn't really matter which one of us it is. It's easier for us to see where we're well hidden. With the lights on. If we just go down here again. And uh And have her simply leave the room. You could just go here for a bit. It's back to Dave. The tentacle should be there. Really shortly, I wonder if he can still see us. I think he still does, actually. Mm hmm. Not sure we could have hidden any better. We were basically completely out of sight. Uh, no, no matter. We can we get out of this. And restore the power again. Yeah. Back from behind there. A bunch of candles in here. The, the reason he doesn't want to pick them up is because they're too heavy. Makes absolutely no sense. Weird. I was thinking we might be able to place those candles in the candlestick in the dungeon, not that I see how that could potentially help us.
Tell them to figure out the way to mail this manuscript either. Okay. I'm pretty sure we've exhausted this idea, but let's try it anyway. Go in here. We'll have twenty trigger the breakers. So just get out of here. Obviously, might as well stay here as well. Really matter. What happens here? Are we able to? Dungeon, he says, where we're currently at. No, there's no way for us to actually. Uh, I was hoping we could sneak in through the door somehow. Uh, alas, no. The tools don't work on the padlock either. I think we already tried that. Might try it again though. Need to uh, turn on the breakers. And if I want to send Bernard down there, I need to go upstairs and push the gargoyle.
I need to go upstairs to get the key. Really dumb. No, that's right. Hey. I think I actually already tried this. Are you sure I did? Okay, we can uh, we can cut the circuit breakers. How does that? Help us! Is there any place in the house we could access with the circuit breakers flip off? That we might not otherwise be able to access. Perhaps a bathroom. Ah, she's locked in there. <laughs> hmm. Go downstairs again. Let her out. We need her to go to the other room and uh, move the breakers. Need Dave there to uh, push the car call so we can access the doors. Doesn't really matter which character we use or what in this particular scenario, but uh, I think can't be stuck in here. He needs to be here at the circuit breakers.
Might as well save when we get up there. Doesn't really matter. But heat up. Have to go all the way up here again. In case we... As we think of another idea to solve this. Okay, so now the theory is we turn off the breakers, which do burn hard. Now in the darkness up here. That's the damn door. I can't see a damn thing. He, he catches Wendy. Wrong room. A horrible thought. Okay, what happens if we bring Wendy up here? And uh, have her catch us while we're in there. And then have another character sneak into the room while she's taking us downstairs. Can we possibly get a peek into the room? While she's not there. Yes. Can. The key there. Okay, we have a finite time to do this. But we can access another room by doing this. It to be this needs to be Dave because he's the only one that has the flashlight. It's pitch dark up there. On a plan is sound. The execution however was lacking. Get in position.
This variation, let's have Bernard open the door here. Save right here. This might take a few attempts. I don't. Bernard goes in. We switch to Dave. He goes in the room. Picks up the key. Goes up the ladder. He never sees us. We turn on the flashlight. See if we can find a light switch. We are. This is an absolutely terrible painting. <laughs> it has to work sometimes. <laughs> okay, there's a safe up here. There's a number here on the wall. I'm tiny to read. Open the flashlight. No. House in this room, right? Oh. No. The number is right there. And uh, we need some way of being able to read it. Okay, this is progress though. Obviously we need to... Uh... It's really Bernard that uh, needs to get caught here because he's the one that has the key. No, he's really the only one she can catch and let himself out. Uh, take a better peek at this room bottle of perfume here he doesn't want the bottle of perfume Don't open this desk either so there's no drawer no drawer on the desk that we can open glad we saved there and just Go back and forth here a bit.
We have very limited time to do this. This phone here. Not entirely sure there's anything else in this room we could possibly use. What we need really is some sort of magnifying glass. Um, let's do what we can do. We have this key. We need this key for something else. Let's escape up here. It doesn't seem to actually be able to catch us. The game gives us a little bit of a break here. There was this light somewhere here. Here. Okay. Now we can switch back to Bernard and uh, have him unlock himself. I need Wendy to get up there. Doesn't really have to be down here. Luckily, you can, uh, can get out of the door, even though the door is closed from the outside. I would, I sort of could have uh, done that to us as well, made it a little bit more difficult. I suppose we could have her catch us as well, but uh, I think this is slightly easier. Go up here, have our catch Bernard again. He already has the key anyway. And let himself out. In the meantime, we sneak down again with the key and get out of the room and try to figure out what this key does for us. Whether it enables us to find an object we can actually use to read that combination to that safe. Switch back to Dave, he needs to get out of here pronto. Hurry up Dave. Get out. Doesn't really matter. Let both of ourselves out here. Another new key. There are a few locks that we haven't been able to access. So we'll try them in sequence. First up, there's the medical cabinet here. There's the arcade room. Yeah.
Well, this is the key to the arcade machines. Empty. This one is 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 empty. Okay, that ultimately wasn't all that fruitful. This isn't the key for this. Nothing else in here, right? He thinks it's on, but there's no power. So what if we uh, cut the power to the nuclear reactor? Does that restore power to the arcade machines? You can try. Locked in yet again.
Okay. That was ultimately not very fruitful. Where could we find something like a magnifying glass? Ultimately what we really need. Can we uh think we could try giving the arcade cabinet key to Either the tentacle or the boy, see if either of them want it. Fairly sure it won't do anything, but uh, we'll try it anyway. Seems like a lot of work to find a key that uh, doesn't really have any benefit to us. Guess we could try it. What is the... You have to wonder if there is a point to any of these plants. There are plenty of them in a... ...sack as well. Now my question is also, were we supposed to sneak around in this room? Before... Were we supposed to do that before uh, we allied with him? by giving him the package. If we touch anything in here, he becomes pretty cross, but uh, holes, we could do the same. I just head up there. See if we can find anything worth using in there. Basically the same idea, except we sent Bernard in there and uh, we have him do something with his stuff. And while he's uh, taking us downstairs, we ransack his room. See if we can find something we can use. Will be about the last thing we try tonight. I could, I could go on forever with this game, but the game has to end at some point. <laughs> it's nailed and glued to the table. Mm. 
Okay. <laughs> we can't switch. Uh, ah, yeah, ay, yeah, we can't switch characters. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. The idea is sound, but uh, it doesn't actually work. <laughs> Game saw that coming a mile away, but uh, didn't let us use the same trick twice. Of course not. Okay, we can break it. I'm gonna say a load. I also highly doubt that any of this is of any use to us. I really see how it could potentially help us. Charge the flashlight again. We can't get up this hatch here. We can't give the man eating plant. Anything else? He's uh, had his dose of Pepsi. He's perfectly content with the world around him. I think I tried that with every portrait in the game until I uh, until it finally revealed it was safe to me. this one more time see if we we go in there have her catch us whether there is anything more we can do with that with those numbers on the wall yeah 
The only thing I could think of that we could potentially use is this waste. doesn't want to pick it up. Thinking if we w w look through the ways we could use it as a magnifying glass. The only object of glass that I could think of that we could do that with. Other than that jar. I think I tried the jar. See if we can uh, No, doesn't really make any sense either. Just occurred to me. Okay. It was just a thought. Might potentially use the the enlarger to do this, but uh, we can't open it even with the tools. I think we already tried to do that, but... Uh Sort of do repeat yourself in this game. Forget what you've tried and what you haven't. You, know, you keep going back and doing the same thing over and over. At some point. So, hey, to just walk away. Try later. So, let's try this again. We have. Not go in here. Stay. This is a. Uh, Fairly precarious situation. Return to this safe again. Can't do anything with this bed. item we can use here try to figure out if there's something else in this room the way it is there's that painting on the wall 
he might want to take a peek into as well. Doesn't move at all. Suppose we could turn off the light. Doubt that. That's very much for us though. They seem to have x ray vision. So. Again, broom out there. A cracked mirror in there. I could use that though. Time that we have to. Maneuver here is annoyingly short. Can't seem to do anything with the perfume. I don't need to do anything with a mirror. Give door to, yeah. Give the door to the tools. Get in there. We can use the phone, but uh, we don't know how to call. Not Ghostbusters at least. But uh, there is definitely something weird in our neighborhood. Yeah. A nightstand here. No, we can't open that either. See no obvious things to do in there. We already took the key of the nightstand. Can't open the nightstand anymore. There's a mirror on the ceiling as well. The weird little thing.
Okay, I'm pretty much stumped here at the moment. Can't imagine what we could possibly use, at least not anything that we've actually found. do with the glasses that are on his head Save this mess. Jump over to the face cam. See who's on. We might actually raid here. Relatively quiet stream. Not that many of you here. Ash is on. All right, Ash. Thanks for coming, guys. Probably won't be here Friday, so no Legend at Krontor, and uh, I'll probably be back for Saturday stream, but if not, I'll do a Sunday catch-up stream on Madden Magic. Make up for lost time. Won't skip another Madden Magic stream. Thanks for the uh, thanks for coming guys. You have an excellent rest of the night. Sleep well later. <laughs>